Scotland will almost certainly become the first country in Europe to introduce a minimum price for alcohol. The SNP government thinks it's the best way to tackle the serious criminal, social and health problems associated with alcohol abuse. It means that cheap, strong drink will become more expensive. It's the same policy that was rejected by the Scottish Parliament last year. Raymond Buchanan reports. The big argument for minimum pricing is that it's simply too cheap to get too drunk here in Scotland. In fact, ministers claim with just five pounds, a teenager can buy enough booze to kill themselves. So I went to see just how much alcohol you can buy for that kind of cash. Well, that's me just emerged from the shop. I've spent a grand total of four pounds and 94 pence. And this is what I have for my trouble. A large two litre bottle of cider. That's 5% volume. Another two litre bottle of cider. This time though, it's seven and a half percent volume. Well, here we go, another shop, another big bottle of cider, two litres, seven and a half percent volume, 15 units of alcohol apparently. And I also got a bottle of fortified wine, that's 15 percent, but it's alcohol content. Now, the grand total was, well, five pounds and eight pence. So I've blown my budget a little bit but I've also blown my recommended drinks limit for the week. Well, I'm an alcoholic and uh, I'm feeling pretty content today. So getting drunk isn't expensive, but the cost to many lives is. Here at the Castle Craig Hospital in the Borders, they treat addicts. Many sustain their habits by frequent visits to the supermarket. But even when I was unemployable, with alcohol being so cheap uh, and available so easy, I could still drink every day. But the Scottish Government want the days of cheap and strong booze to end. They've reintroduced plans for a minimum unit price for alcohol. It's not a magic bullet solution. We've never said that it is, but it is a crucial part of an overall approach. And right now it's the missing piece of the jigsaw in Scotland. So what difference will it make? Well, the government won't give us exact figures, but last time this bill was considered, they said it could mean a bottle of own brand vodka increasing from 8.35 to 11.85, a two litre bottle of cider going up from 1.20 to 3.75, and a bottle of wine would increase from 3.75 to 4.20. Going for minimum pricing will simply penalise the vast majority of Scots who already drink responsibly. Minimum pricing is likely to pass in Parliament, but may end up in the courts. Critics have questioned whether it's legal. Ministers insist it is. Raymond Buchanan, Reporting Scotland.